WTFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 2 p.m. update. Because we've got a mixed bag out here. You got the Dow down 68, S&P's off three, Nasdaq 100 up 37, Russell's down 19, Semi's up three, Tranny's up nine, New York Stock Exchange off 71, Gold is up two bucks, Silver down two pennies, and 30-year Treasury trade out at 159.11. Let's go spend some time taking a look at the cash indice charts out here. Give me a moment while we change screens in the upper left-hand corner. As soon as we get this fired up. You're going to see the Dow Jones Industrial. This has a uh, confirmed uh, uh, Rhodes Mintum indicator signal. That was generated yesterday. It has a Gartley buy pattern. What it hasn't done, it has not been able to close above for the last five, six days above its oscillator and change line. So the level to be watching there, today's close, is going to be 34,275. If price closes above that, that would suggest that we could see the Dow rally all the way back to that swing point from September 27th. That could get you up into the 35,056 level. We take a look at the S&P 500. What does the S&P 500 chart have for us? Um, not much, really. It has a Gartley buy pattern, but really the Gartley buy pattern on the ES Mini, is the better of the two. The key area here for the S&P 500 to get out of the clear, it needs to close above its oscillator and change line, which is 43.71. That will right now be resistance. The NDX 100, no bottom pattern here. And uh, doesn't mean that it can't rally. It is trying to rally right now. If it does continue to rally, you can see that oscillator and change line change colors about four days ago. That would be the price that it would seek. And that's at about the 14.909 level. The Russell 2000's got a buy the D point right at the uh, support level, the breakout support at 21.69. So only a close below that would negate its pattern. The semi is still trying to hold on to their support level, and that's at the 3216 area. Uh, no bottoming pattern that I see at this uh, moment. Um, yet no bottoming pattern. Dow Jones Transports, uh, they are the ones that are up the largest, right? Uh, no, they're flat, basically. So, uh, But they did generate a uh, Rhodes Mintum indicator signal. Price really is targeting its swing point from the trading day of September 27th. The high of that pattern is 14,588. And the XAU has got a nice uh, Rhodes, it's got a nice uh, TD nine count bottom. Nice hammer yesterday. So definitely trying to hammer out a bottom inside the mining equities. Folks, stay tuned. Your favorite polar bear, David Noade, is up next with the Power Trading Hour. I'll be back with you tomorrow on Terrific Thursday. Have a wonderful Wednesday.